The Meadows Turkey Bowl has been going three decades strong now, and this year the pandemic didn't stop players from lacing up their cleats and raising more than $400,000 for families battling cancer. And as News 5's Tanisha Cordell shows us, the game took on even more meaning this year after a member of the Meadows family received his own unexpected cancer diagnosis. Their mission has stood strong for years, helping families fight cancer through their annual Meadows Turkey Bowl. Thank you for coming out. But founder Mike Meadows says after three decades of organizing the game, never did he imagine cancer would hit home with his son. We really used Pete's situation as motivation to go out and help more people. January 14th, I collapsed, had seizures. Um, was diagnosed with a uh, grade two dendroglioma tumor. Pete Meadows says the day he was diagnosed, his world came crashing down. When you're told you, know, you have cancer, you know, a lot of things rush you know, to your head. But relief came about a month later. The tumor that had invaded Pete's brain was removed. I just give all the credit back to God, personally, where I'm at today, because I should have had chemo and radiation. I, I probably shouldn't have been playing in this game. It's why the Meadows say this year's Turkey Bowl is special. This year we raised $416,000 for families in Northeast Ohio. Last year, teams raised $390,000. The money is split between St. Vincent de Paul Society and the Mary Grace Memorial Foundation. This event is not just a bunch of knuckleheads playing backyard football game. As time goes by, the Meadows know the need will only get bigger across Northeast Ohio. Imagine a family battling, I know they're out there, family battling cancer. They're hit with the coronavirus. They may lose a job during this pandemic. But so will their hearts and efforts to help families come out on top as winners, defeating their unique battles with cancer. <laughs> Tanisha Cordell, News 5.